Zell Boy Army, what is going on? It is your boy Zelodius, my beautiful, spicy friend back here, Mr. Aims Hat, here today with another banger of video for you. We're rating your teams. I sent a tweet out, got lots of replies to it, got lots of spicy teams to look at today. So we're going to go through loads of your teams, have a look at them, look at who I, talk about what I like in the team, talk about maybe who your next purchase could be. It's going to be a spicy one. Make sure you stick around to the end to see if your team's been put in. If we can smash the likes on this video, if we get over 100 likes and this video is popular, I could make this a weekly thing where I go through your guys' teams and give you weekly advice on it. But it needs to be popular. I need to know you guys enjoy the content because I only want content on this channel that you guys are enjoying. It's spicy and good enough for you boys. Okay? So, appreciate all the support. 10,000 subscribers. That's pretty crazy, like. We've got up a few thousand in just the last month or two. Massively appreciate the support. Big thank you to everyone who's ever supported any of the streams I've done, my YouTube videos, the comments, the likes, everything. It really does mean a lot. And I'm doing videos every single day because of you boys now. I'm grinding YouTube harder than ever. It's thanks to you guys. Really appreciate the support. Anyway, like I said, let's smash the like button on this video. Check if your team's been put in there. Let me know in the comments what you think about some of the teams you see, if I've commented on your team or what you think. Appreciate the support so much, boys. Let's have a spicy one. Okay, boys, we are on my Twitter. You can see, if you don't already follow my Twitter, what are you doing with yourself? Get it followed, at Zelonius. If these videos are popular and you guys enjoy me looking through different teams, rating them, giving my pro and head coach opinion on them smash the like button follow my twitter and then we'll make this a weekly thing where i will go through your teams once a week and give you advice so as long as anyone who doesn't realize this i am the head coach and a pro player for roma esports let's go find the tweet uh, if you haven't seen this by the way fifa analyst guy that i run a patron with a jambu he's doing a 24 hour charity stream on saturday Make sure you get involved in that. Great guy. Uh, where are we? Where did I just put the tweet? Here we go. We'll look through this bit first. Okay. Josh Davies. I said high quality pictures, Josh. I don't know what you're doing here, with, mate. This isn't a high quality picture, but it's a high quality team. So we'll go ahead with it. Josh is a member of the Patreon that I run with Jambu and FIFA analyst. He, I think, went from like 22, 23 wins to 26 wins, I think last week so lots of improvement there from Josh if you've not seen about the patron before check out the link in the description below today is the first day of the month which is the best time to sign up to the patron you get a whole month of content lots of people improving drastically in the patron you get access to me FIFA analyst and Jambu a pro a great YouTube and Ali's a top, uh, near he's hit top 100 before he's generally elite one every week as well great streamer uh, me, head coach, pro player from Roma. Lots of access to great guys who help you improve at the game. The growing community that's dedicated to helping you improve at FIFA. So make sure you check it out. So Josh's team. Van Sarinet, I rate. That back four is unreal. De Ligt is probably the second best centre back in the game. That Ramos is brilliant value. Um, everyone on, is on full chem except for uh, Ramos, which is very good. It's made on Sandro, two of the best fullbacks in the game. He packed that R9, untradeable from the mid icon pack. Just jabby sod, that is incredible pack look. And then Josh has probably been taking on my advice how much I love five star weak foots. Uh, okay, Saint Maxim in on full career, but still more than good enough. Neymar, Saint Maxim, Boutre, R9, all, on, uh, all our five star weak foots, brilliant. And then Makaleli and De Jong, very good. I really like that team. I think the weakest link in the team would probably be um, Makaleli, but Makaleli is still very good. I just prefer players that have a better weak, not weak foot, better attacking option at CDM, so you can still tap with him. But he's still a very good option. Not really too many weak points in that team. Uma, go up from my stream. Van der Sar in net. You're probably going to see quite a lot of that. I rate the back four. Um, Firmino and Blanc at CDM, very good. It's a very meta team. Pretty much all of these players you've seen seeing lots of teams regularly. Um, I think the next upgrades for me would be either the fullbacks. They're good and they're very good value. You can't get much better value than them, to be honest. But um, at fullback, they're still a little bit lower age. You could upgrade them to better versions. 
Uh, and then I don't like CR7 that much on the game. And he's off chem as well. I would probably get rid of him for a five star week for Icon. Or maybe even like, actually no, this is what my upgrade would be, Uma. Get a Talon. A Tal's shapeshifter card is better than um, that CR7 in my opinion. And did get full chemistry. So that'd be my upgrade there. Kaka and Anders and Carmen tradable. My trade below sell 100% I've got 360k left. Okay, so moments Kaka. Getting rid of him. That'll give you a lot of coins. Got a power on full chem. That power just looks like an animal, man. It looks crazy. He's probably the second or third best centre back in the game. Uh, Kaka and Anders and Carmen are tradable. So that's like... One, five. It's got seven million coins you're gonna have. I would just get in some very good five star weak foots in the attack. Um, your full backs are already fantastic. Uh, I'm trying to think what else I'd recommend. Rykard, I don't think it's the best, but he's untradeable, I think. Yeah, he's untradeable. Um, very good team. You like your SBCs, I'm guessing, from having R9 and Rykard, I'm guessing they're baby. Prime icon packs, and then your full backs of power. I like the team, very good players. With the tradable players you get rid of, I would probably bring in some five star weak foots. Adam Astor. That tweet end there. Well, we'll look at him in a sec. Uh, Kenny into Circa, Sweaty Pair of CDMs, very good though. Ribery, Messi, John Barnes. Oh, does he have three? He might be playing the narrow actually. Okay. I'd probably get rid of Barnes for someone with five star weak foot, but he might be untradeable. Pereira's very good. I like his centre backs a lot. Um, that Semedo's good for the chemistry to Messi. You're not going to get rid of Messi, obviously, because of a um, very good card. Untradeable. 1.4 million coins. I'd probably replace Barnes, but he might be untradeable. That's the issue. I just think Barnes is good. But I want five star weak foots in my attack, and Messi's better than Bards if they're both untradeable. Hi, Ty. Nice Twitter day. Neuer, uh, that back four, very solid. Zanetti is better than a lot of people think. If Prime R9 is tradable, I would probably sell him to improve the rest of the team because he is a crazy expensive card. But he is a brilliant card. If you packed him untradable, GG's, that is an insane pull. Let's check it is recorded, yeah. Um, Bernardo Silva, for me, is a weak link. The three-star weak that just lets him down. I'd probably get something like St. Maximin. 800 to a million... 800k to a million coins. Five-star weak for quicker. Just better than that Bernardo Silva. Thomas Delaney as well. Maybe get an icon in instead of him because you've got a lot of tradable coins. Um, yeah, very good team. Pele and R9, though, if they're tradable, they're probably not the best value for what they are. Let's go. So it says... 36 replies there. I think. Yeah, 36. Because I don't want to miss... Okay, now it's showing a bunch more. Oh, I did. Yeah, okay, okay. Didn't load them in before. Clevin. 43 won in games, so can't it Pogba? Pogba I don't like. I'd be replacing him. He might be getting a foot birthday card. Five star weak foot, five star skills. If he does... This fuel grades that'll be a sick card. I will do a video on Friday to look at all the foot birthday cards that we get, by the way. So make sure you check that out for my opinions on them. Bellerin, Fernandez, good. Nedved, Cruyff, good. No, I think that's Bergwin, is it? Uh, no, it's not. I can't remember his name. But I think he's okay, but not that good. Uh, it's okay. I don't like Pogba that much. Lenglet put a chem style on him. You want to boost his uh, pace. His main issue is just he's a bit slow. But I like that team. 2.5 million to spend. 2.5 million to spend only use 5 star weak foot strikers. Yeah, good man Oli. You should only use 5 star weak foot strikers. I don't know what formation you played in game. Uh, hmm. Well... Players like St. Maxim, Butra, they're very good strikers for cheap. That uh, Ozil's cheap. You like a few SBCs, no? Is that Ryan Kent's a bit of a beast for what it costs? Oblak, fine. Not sure what Semedo's doing in there. That one, it's a bit hard to know what to do with that because I don't know what formation you're playing in game, Oli. Let me know about that next time. Benjamin Tradables. Yeah, none of them are that good to start, to be honest. Uh. 
he's going to be untradeable, I'm guessing. Yep. I probably would play Semedo off Kem because he doesn't need the pace Kem stars much. Get a manager, though, it gives him seven chemistry. Vidal, Frankie up in CDMs. Hazard, Pele, there we go. Very good team. If Pele is tradable, I would sell him and get a five star weak for him. But if he's a baby icon, great pull. Still very good card. We've seen Joshua's team. Yeah, didn't he say high quality? We did, Reese. Thank you. Um, not a fee for ultimate team, but a pretty good prem team, mate. Fair enough. Yeah, get rid of Bartra. He's a dosser. Um, Marcelo, don't know why he did the SBC, but he's alright. Moment Slitman, good. One of the better um, SBCs. Oh, one of the better icon swaps. Senzio, don't know why you do him. Three star weak foot. You need to get more five star weak foots in your life. Uh, what's your name? Graham, yeah. Five star weak foots make a big difference in the attack. They make you a lot less predictable. I like quite a few of the players, but in the attack, you need some five star weak foots. If if he's tradable, sell him and get a five star weak foot. Five star weak foot is just essential on the game, in my opinion. It just makes it a lot easier to um, attack. Megan, let's look at your team. Okay, I'm guessing, you, I think you said in one of the replies you fairly knew. I've only really started playing it properly. Yeah, so what I'd recommend, Megan, is check out a few of the videos I've done lately about looking at some of the cheap alternative meta players. I've done a few videos on that. That I'd recommend you some very cheap players that you can start the game off with. I think this strike is pretty decent for a free card. If you've got 500k, um, rather than just build you a complete new team, I'd recommend watching that video. If you go over that video, It'll give you lots of cheap players that could improve your team quite drastically. Kynes, um, this cab here, Florid Kynes, he's one of the players I recommend in there. But yeah, check out the video. That'll help you improve your team drastically. Welcome to FIFA as well. Replacing Filippo, team media to lit next week. Uh, yeah, that... um. Look, Felipe Luis and Juan Jesus is a brilliant partnership. I highly recommend that. I've talked about in videos. I think my first change in this team would be Milinkovic Savic out. It's just a little bit clunky. Not the easiest to link into teams. Um, I quite like the team. Not enough five star weak foot. With CR7 and Messi, that's two out of your four attackers. Nedved and Mikatero are pretty good. Um, I like the Roma so links in there. Appreciate that, Lamad. But yeah, get rid of CR7 for a 5 star weak foot striker and get rid of Lincoln Savage would be my opinion. Whole team untradeable. We've got one of them. Think about doing Marmont Sane and starting a 4 for a 3. Don't do Marmont Sane. He looks really good, but the 3 star weak foot kills him. Whole team's untradeable. Mm. Not very easy to upgrade them. You could easily get the Winter Refresh Sulch. I think he's a tradable card. Having a few tradable cards in is pretty useful um, because it just means that you've got a few more coins and players to play about with. That hazard was a nice pull and tradable. 1.5 million to spend, need a striker. Uh, got Footmas Vidal, Forms, B Prime, Pep Guardiola on the bench. Think of Night Force, CR7 or an icon. Don't get CR7. I only really think the top value CR7 is that good. Nice team. Some pretty good untradables in there. Go for an icon with five star weak for like a Dalgleish or a Butragrano. That'd be my recommendation. Um, you could even play a Tal off chemistry, but you would put these two off chemistry, so you might be able to mess around with some other um, formations how to do that. Because a Tal is a very good value. Uh, this team. Very good. We're going to speed up a little bit because there's a lot of teams and I don't want to miss people's out. Uh, I like a Tal a lot. Best value player in the game. I don't think this baby Rio is actually that good in my opinion, but for chemistry he's very useful. Very good back four. Yeah, really like that team. Marcel is a goat as well. Occasionally I flick to see how long the video has been, boys. Uh, Trezeguet, Aston Villa boy, I like it. Not sure what to upgrade. The next upgrade I would make in this team, Bernardo Silva out, St. Maximin. Five star weak foot. You're not miles off on the coins. St. Maximin would be a huge upgrade in that position. 4 2 3 1 in game. Oops. That's a very good pair of CDM. I like the strikers. 
if he had five star week for this Martinez would be unreal. Very good. Um, uh, Luis and Hernandez Cedia. Yeah. Bruno, I'm not sure about. I don't. I don't know why people did him as a can. Maybe you're a Man U fan, but I just think he was overpriced. Luis and uh, what you call it, Hernandez at centre backs, pretty beast. So they're very good. Um, very good full that's, the, that's a really nice team I like that team it's different as well which I like to see different teams anyone who watches my streams if you don't link in the description below I like using different teams I like trying out different players find the game more fun that way love Richarlison first one I've seen in this headline of a run bit expensive but very very good Campbell you just have to be a bit careful on the ball I don't like Mohamed Sane because of the weak foot but he does give chemistry to Ozil for the most part I quite like this team I like how you've built it. Um, if Robertson's tradable, I don't think he's worth it in my opinion, but nice team. 4 4 2, 4 2 3, 1 in game. Can't see your teammate. Second pictures in game. I'd replace Lineker and Sane, personally. There's just too many, like, f f two freestyle weak foots. Lineker, not that good. Defence is pretty good. Get rid of Ariola and get in a proper keeper. Get Stegen in. Stegen's 30 or 40k and will do miles better. Instant improvement to your team, Kieran. Leon's team, narrowing game. Been trying to improve for a while. Lots of trade balls to raise. Uh, what would upgrade here? I would get Mendy in, but I guess you need Alba for chemistry to be fair. Uh, I like Rooney, he's very good. Tovan, I don't know why I'd do him. He looked decent, but the weak foot lets him down. I guess it's chemistry, isn't it? I like these two. Cyprian is pretty good as well. Because you've got Cyprian, get a Tal. A Tal is one of the best value players in the game. And it's a strong link to Cyprian. He'll link to either of these. Um, Trent as well. Rooney will still be on 8 chem regardless, so I'd probably get a better right back. But I guess you need the English link. It's hard. You've got quite a few um, different type of links in there. Should I replace Bobby or Neymar? Replace Bobby first. Neymar's the best gold card in the game. Um, nice team. Now, that back four is incredible. And then the team in the year Mbappe is crazy. What I would say is if he is tradable, sell him and either get the 93, which is way cheaper, so you've got more coins than the rest of the team, or get the foot birthday card. Because the foot birthday is better than this Mbappe because of the weak foot. Four mil besides untradable. Neymar's an 80 right in SCM. Yeah, it's the best team we can get for that money. Don't like a par. Hmm. I don't like CR7. So personally, I'd get rid of CR7 with someone else. Maybe an icon. Give Neymar full chem as well. Most of the players in that team I like a lot. I'd get rid of Storch, Cov, and CR7 though to get um, uh, better weak for attackers personally. Tradable. Play 4 2 3 1. Via, not as good as he should be because he's not the weak for anymore. For the price of these players, though, I like most of them. Morales, maybe you could replace him next, but a lot of these players are very good and I rate them. Uh, for your team, Dalglish or Canavaro? Hmm. I'd go Dalglish for your team. I think you need an attacker more with five star weak foot. To be honest, Barry, if you're watching this video, I don't really even know what the optimal settings are. I have, I have the. Um, Doomer OS Netgear Router and um, yeah I, I still get bad gameplay pretty cheap team here Jason I like the back four though the back four is very good done a good job of getting them on chemistry Forsby is very good value I think the next upgrades would be Lucas and then Kalu hold to defence plus two centimeters yeah Bellarabi is really good for free by the way nice team Bellarabi will be a good little addition in there um I'd probably replace AUR next. We're going to just go through quick. We've seen this team. We've seen this team because I want to get to more teams. Uh, solid team. Next upgrades would be Sane, Mane, and Messi, I'd say. As in, replace them. That Guerrero doesn't look as good as I thought, to be honest. He's got a lot of bad stats. Roy Stabala would probably be the first upgrades I'd do for that team, though, Eric. I like the Dow, I like the back four. A lot of people have really good defence at most. Which is good because it's easy to get a good cheap defence. Half a million tradable. Bit of Bundesliga hybrid. 
Luis Felipe, brilliant card. Nice team. I've seen this one. Stuck in Division 8, don't know what to do. Sign up to the Patreon and get someone quicker than Aguero. If you get enough coins, upgrade Aguero to a 5 star weak foot striker and get rid of Vardy. Vardy's 3 star weak foot lets him down. Don't know what to upgrade next. Upgrade AUR and upgrade your Mbappe, I would say. Upgrade AUR to a, an icon CDM like Vieira or something. It would give Mendy full chem as well. Zidane is untradeable. Very nice team. Yeah, I like everyone on that team. That Valencia is a beast as well, just hard to link in. Next upgrade would be Cam Neymar, I guess, but very good team. Jack, very good team. I'd get rid of uh, Firmino next, probably. I think the front three are the weakness here. You might be a Liverpool fan, I guess, with that front three. Um, just that none of them have five star weak foots. Five star weak foots would be good. Dejeni is very good value um, for his card. Put a basic as well on to stay. Basic works better on keepers. Okay. That was the first part. I've got 57 replies to a Luminec. Okay. We're going to speed through this up. Video has been 20 minutes. Okay. Speed through this. Very good team. Jacko, I think someone who watches my streams, it's top 100, so it doesn't surprise me. One, he has a good team, and two, he knows what he's doing with his team. Next upgrade, I'd probably say Vinicius or Lucas. Uh, very good team. The type of team I would build. I've used all these players except for Dow, partly because he was SPC and liked them. Uh, I don't even know I'd recommend to upgrade next. Probably an icon centre back instead of Militar. Seems like these these teams are even more like sweaty, like top meta icon teams. You guys already know what you're doing with these. Uh, I would upgrade one of these to a better version of them, probably. Desai Mendit here. Only untradeable. Quite a few untradeables than Lucas, mate. Could upgrade De Jong to his team in the year long term. Don't think he's. But he is cheap and very good value. Uh, yeah, De Jong, CR7, Messi, can't they? One of those upgrade. I want people. Oh, you put it there. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Very good team. Rashford, nice card of the five star week foot. I'd upgrade Hierro next. Get a five star week foot icon attacker and chemistry links everyone in. Very good. Very good defence. I like these two a lot. Aidan McGeady, pretty good card. Interesting. I have linked to him with Roy Keane. I like how he's done that. Thank you, Jonas. Appreciate that you're enjoying the content. Jack, you greedy boy. You've already put the team in. 200k won't save it more. Upgrade the defence. Defence for 200k. You can easily upgrade that. Look at some of our videos about the best defender, meta defenders. Easy to be able to improve it in there. That doesn't feel like 57 replies to that. Do I need to keep reloading? Okay, here we go. Here's some more. Only trade was Van Basten and play this in game. Why is that Van Basten like that, by the way? Let me know. I love Van Basten's cards on um, the old FIFAs, but I'm not trying them out. My next upgrade would probably be um, Piero out. Personally, out of those, he's just a bit slow and not very strong. Portic on Felix and Hazard wide. Thoughts of changing Felix for Griezmann, changing Zanetti for Kapita. Um, I wouldn't get rid of Zanetti when he's an untradeable, probably from the first icon swaps. He's very good anyway. Very good team, though, Axel. I would get rid of um, Felix first. I don't think this Felix is actually that good. I think you'd be able to get a better icon in. Untradeable FC. Very nice team. You got untradeable R9, bloody heck. Munayin, I'd probably upgrade to an icon. You can play players on 8 chemistry, by the way. Anyone who's worried about that, 8 chemistry is completely fine. It's a nice team, though, Josh. Very good team. It would just be a case of upgrading one of these three next, I'd say, mate. Personally. I like that team, though. We've already seen Jacko's. Kelly's team. Bit of Bundesliga magic. That McKenny's actually pretty good. Havertz. 
Easy 400k upgrade. That Havertz is foot birthday card, one of the best value cards in the game, in my opinion. So I'd look to upgrade Havertz to the foot birthday one, Kelly. Um, and then you've always got the Lewandowski potentially upgrade him to um, his headliners, which is, again, very good value. Defense is very good. These two are really good value. Yeah, I like the team. That's good. I like seeing different leagues as well. Need some serious help. Use my 4-2-3-1 video. You can easily transition to that. And then get a five-star weak foot attacker and have these two at CDM. That would be my advice. Berets is a placeholder. Good. Not Berets is not very good. 3-5-2 in game. <laughs> Delay champs. Berets you just get a quick and strong centre-back. Easy as that. Hmm. Even like foot swaps like Maldini or Cannavaro there do. Like the team though. Nice team. I like it. I like the different players you put in there. Yeah, it's a good team though. Pretty much a similar team to what I've seen from you before, Sean, but yeah, I like it. That Lewandowski is a beast. Sean got this untradeable. And I'm not sure about Mateus, but I like most of the team. These cards, like Messi and Bappi Neymar, you can always upgrade them. Don't like Pogba, Sane or Bale, I'm not going to lie. Um, Alonso is a bit slow. I'd upgrade to a quicker left back. I'd upgrade to better weak foots than um, Sane and Bale, and then you could get a better version of Son. The OBS breaker. Again, don't like Bale that much. I haven't seen him at all, I've seen two of him. Um, Messi is a very good team in there. I like the defense for the most part. That's very good. Very good CDMs. Just need a five-star weak foot attacker to replace Bale. I'd say. Then the team's very good. That Werner's pretty good. I have the 88. Mm. I would replace Tovan. I'm not sure who I'd replace him with. To be honest, at left wing, probably. Oh no, yeah. Get Neymar and play Mendy on eight chemistry. Mendy would be fine on eight chemistry. Decent team though. It's a lot nice seeing different teams. I don't like CR7. I'd get an icon in with five star weak foot to replace CR7. And then um, Sandro on eight chem, fine. But he'd get Neymar and full chem. We've seen this team. This is not a high quality picture, Joshua. They're on every, everything untradeable. Upgrade the Varan or Pogba, I'd say. Foot birth to Tillerman, not foot birth. Future star Tillerman is pretty good, but don't have the chemistry, I guess, in that team. 400k. Uh, 400k for a striker. Good question. I'd probably save up long term and go for that um, f yeah, foot birth to Maxim. Seedorf and Crespo. Nice team. It's good to see some different icons. I'd probably upgrade Sade off next. Two mil to improve. It's hard to improve this team. It's pretty insane. I would probably get a top icon centre back over um, Diego Carlos. Maybe even use your foot swaps to do that Maldini or Cannavaro. And then you could probably upgrade um, Sissoko to someone better. We've seen that team. Untradeable. How many of you boys? You boys just. You put in EA's hands, you do it every SBC, it seems. Very good team, though. Uh, just get a five star weak foot icon in there that fits the team, I'd say. Butra 90 is very good. Upgrade Militar. Easy upgrade, Bart. We've seen that one, we've seen the. No, we haven't seen this. Very nice team. Uh. I'm not sure. I'd probably get an icon centre back over now. Get a top icon centre back. It's a cool team, that's some different players. Probably upgrade Vinicius or Politano next. We've seen that. We've seen that. Okay. I think we've done it, boys. That was like 90 plus teams. If I missed your team, I apologise. I've tried to go through every single team, tried to evaluate them, give you some advice. I obviously haven't gone fully in depth on every team because if I did it'd be a three hour video. I appreciate the support on the channel, I appreciate so much of you, respect my opinion enough that you wanted to 
get involved in this video, you wanted me to look at your teams. If I missed your team, I apologise. I'm trying my best to go for all of them. Like I said, smash the like button. Let me know in the comments what you thought of this. If this has been popular, we will do this once a week and I will go for your teams. If you want more in-depth advice on your team, want to get improve at the game, I'd recommend the Patreon. You get more access to me, FIFA, Arnes and Jambu. I also offer one-on-one -on -one coaching. If you're interested in that, contact me on my Twitter. That's Zaloni, at Zalonis on my Instagram Zalonius FIFA those two ways you can contact me and privately message me like I say offer one to one coaching so if you're interested want to get coached by the Roma Esports head coach the pro player let me know lots of people I've probably had over 200 people that I've coached over the years that have improved a lot I've got lots of people do it now and I'm very happy with it yeah that's what you with that as well, it'd be an hour long lesson where you'd get to play against me and I'd be on a call with you so you get to talk to me and I'd give you more in-depth analysis on your team, etc. Um, appreciate the video a lot though. Appreciate the video. Well, I hope you guys appreciate the video. Appreciate all the support that so many people wanted me to rate the teams. I really do love the Zellboy Army. I appreciate the support so much. Thank you for everything you do for me. I appreciate you boys. Hope you've enjoyed this video. I'll be back tomorrow with another spicy one.